Hey everyone, this is Kenny from Broad Street, and I'm going to give you a quick demo of the new editable ad feature that we just put out. So sometimes you have an advertiser that has good reason to want to change the ad on your site. So maybe you sold them an advertisement and it's been running for, you know, two, three, six, twelve months and it hasn't really changed. Well, if you have an advertiser like a restaurant, maybe they do want to update their ad with, you know, maybe whatever is going on for lunch. So just to give you an idea of what editable ads actually do, we're going to jump into the uh, widget section. So editable ads come in the form of a widget. So we'll go to widgets. And you can see that right here we have a new widget type called Broad Street Editable Ad. So we're going to drag that into the sidebar and get rid of the title here. And we're going to say, all right, I want to create a new editable ad. So you can see here that advertisers can update their ad by text message, uh, it can come by Facebook or Twitter. And we give you some handy instructions along the way to uh, show you how to do that. And if this is something you end up wanting to use, you can click the sales material link down here. And you can also check out the uh, designer specifications if you have a designer and you need to tell them how to create an ad. The basic gist is just to create a regular old ad but leave some space for editable text. So here we're going to pick uh, an ad, and this is one of the first advertisers that ever used editable ads. We're going to say, okay, whatever this advertiser sends by text message should show up right here. We're going to pick a nice font, and we're going to say, okay, let's see how it looks. So we're going to click this, we're going to generate a proof so we can see what it looks like ahead of time. And can see, all right, cool. It says check this ad for updates. Now when this advertiser updates the ad, that text will change. But we're going to keep going. So we're going to say this advertiser should be able to update it by text message, uh, Facebook or Twitter. And in this case, we'll just uh, we'll pick text message. We'll enter in a, uh, a phone number here. And you can pick the destination. And maybe, for example, this goes to mammothmeats.com. All right, and say, okay, cool. This is how it looks. And we should enter the advertiser's name here just so if you ever log into the Broad Street dashboard, everything's organized and you can see uh, where these ads are. And say, so make it happen. Now, everyone gets two free editable ads off the bat. Um, so you can try it out, play with it. And after that, it's $25 per month. And we only charge if the ad serves more than, uh, you know, maybe 25 times a day. And you only get charged per day. So if, you know, you only run the ad for two weeks, you get charged half of that. So at Red Bank Green, where we first launched this, uh, we tend to upsell these ads. So it's $25 per ad, but we charge the advertisers a lot more than that. So typically if we charge $200 for an ad per month, we charge $350 per ad per month if this editable ad technology was involved. So you say, all right, let's make it happen. So the ad's being created right now. When it's done, it's going to get placed in our, uh, our widget. All right, so it just got placed. You can see it says ready to go, do not edit. We're going to save it. All right, cool. So if we refresh the page, and this isn't required, but if we refresh the page, we'll see what ad is, is running in this slot right here. Okay, cool. And now if we go to our site, you'll see this new ad. Now any update that our uh, advertiser here sends by text message, that'll get placed here in about two minutes. So like I said, this is something that a lot, a lot of advertisers for us has, have really enjoyed using and uh, it's really changed how they use or how they actually reach out to uh, the readers on our site.